Hi there. So I got my Body Boss 2.0 a little over a week ago and I wanted to unbox it and well I've already used it but rebox it and unbox it so you can see what comes in the box and also kind of tell you what my thoughts are on, it, are on it after I've used it for a little over a week or so. So this is the box and what it looks like. Um, it's not very heavy at all. The box is rather large. Um, when you open it up, so let me tilt my camera down so you can see better. All right, so you open it up and you get this really cool carrying bag with it that fits all of your accessories in it. So I'll put back everything so you can see. So it fits all of your accessories in it. And your accessories are your different cables. Let me tilt that back up a bit and I'll open it. So they're your different cables and they're pretty sturdy. I like the, uh, the scrunchy part right here. It um, just helps to keep, uh, for me, some of the resistance bands I've had, sometimes if you're doing it over your head, they kind of, the rubbery part gets caught in your hair if you have long hair. Um, for me, I like the scrunchy part because then I don't have that issue. So mine came with four cables total. It came with the squat bar, which can also be used for things other than squats, but this was actually primarily the reason why I purchased this. Um, I was looking to do squats at home and I didn't want a big heavy squat rack that took up a lot of space at my house. So this product, I can, I can put it in a small closet, I can put it in a cabinet in my home. Um, so it doesn't take up a lot of space. So to put the squat rack together, you just screw it on like this, right there. And then you would attach your resistance cables on either end. They have a hook and what's nice about it is the hook spins so it's not stationary so you don't have to worry about it getting twisted up. So there's the squat rack, uh, squat bar, but also it's not just a squat bar. Um, it can be used for other things as well. Then you got some additional handles to connect to the resistance bars. You get two of these ones. Uh, you have the door stopper to put it in the door to do additional workouts that way. So some upper body ones. Uh, a band and then another door stopper one. So you can uh, put the system into the door and use it to go like this for your arms as well. And then another band. These can be put on your legs if you wanna do some leg workouts. So it all fits into this nice little bag right here. You can put this on the ground. And then the base is what's next in this. And here's the base. Let me just put my box on the ground. So here's the base. Now the base is folded in half like this. You just take your handles and you open it up. Now under, on the other side, you'll notice this is the part that goes on the floor. What's really nice about that is they have these little circles right here that are padded, so it helps to protect your floor. And that's important for me because I have wood floors here. So let me tilt this camera down a little bit so you can see better. All right, so this is the base right here. Now, there are different hooks, and if you go on their website, it's actually, I'll tilt it up a little bit. There's different hooks, and if you go on their website, it'll tell you how to use these hooks and what to put the resistance cables on to do different exercises. Um, but different positions give you different exercises. Now, the resistance bands clip on really easily, so you just take it, clip it like this, and then you can clip this other end to whichever accessory you wanna use depending on the exercise. If you want to make more resistance, you can actually use two different hooks, and on the website it shows you, but you can go in like this, and you can hook them this way. Um, sorry, I'm just trying to weave that through there. Right there, and you can hook it and go that way to give it a little more resistance. Uh, there are countless different ways to do it. So let me go ahead and set it up for a squat and show you how that looks. So I'm gonna use number three. I'm going to put two on here. So I put two like this. And I'm going to take my other end and hook it up to my squat bar. So right like that. And then the other end right here. All right, 
So that's easy, it's all set up. I'll put it on the ground and show you how it works. So I'm gonna bring this a little closer so you can see. All right. So I take this squat bar and I bring it up like this. And I'll adjust this up so you can see better now. And you can put it over your head. You can do your squats in any specific way you want. But like this, you hold it up and you'll notice when I bring the camera over. Sorry, I don't have anyone helping me. So you have it like this and you can do your squats. And you have your resistance right there. And like I said before, you can change the amount of resistance on here. You can do different exercises with this. You can do twists. You can do your regular squats. You can use this. And if you have a bench, you can lay on your bench and you can do chest exercises. You can do curls with this. You can do all different exercises. And what the best part about this is it's very small. It's super compact. And I'll show it to you again. This is it right here. Very small, packs up really well. Definitely a, a good investment as far as money goes. Um, I saved money by not getting a squat rack. I saved space by not getting one. Uh, you can do so many different exercises. You can work all parts of your body. And the company's really great. If you have questions, you can reach out to them. I've reached out a couple times. Um, and they also provide a lot of great exercise videos, which I love too. So overall, I think the Body Boss is definitely worth its money uh, and is the only at-home small piece of equipment that's portable that I was able to find that had a squat, uh, squat bar. So that was something that's important to me. So overall, I would say that I like the exercises that I can do with the Body Boss. I like how compact it is. Uh, so far, in the little minute of time I've had, I haven't had any issues with durability. Um, everything seems to be made really well. I like the padding on all of the accessories for your hands so it doesn't hurt your hands. Um, so overall, if you're kind of on the fence about it, I would say go ahead and buy it, especially because it most of the time uh, it's sold by Prime. That's how I purchased it. So you can always return it if you don't like it. Um, but I can't imagine you wouldn't like it. Um, so that's my review. I hope it helps you.